Hello YouTube. It's almost April 2021 and Corona is still hanging around. More and more of us are working from home. And today's video is about how to make our life a little more easier by hooking up more monitors to your computer so that you can ease your work. Having different monitors while you're working is actually a godsend. You can actually make your life much easy if you are actually somebody who works with computer. So I myself is a software engineer, so I want to share how I set up my system so that I so that will be helpful for some of you. Welcome to Jeek's Authority. It's a channel where, where I, I share helpful thoughts to save you money and bring some new ideas. If you haven't subscribed, consider doing so and thank you in advance for doing that. So this is my setup. I have actually, you can see, I can, I have three monitors, one 32 inch curved monitor, 24 inch uh, Lenovo ThinkVision and a 21 inch Lenovo and my laptop. And my laptop does not support that many um, docks. So this is actually what I use to set it up, okay? So you just place your monitors in the right way so that it will be good for your eyes as well. Here, this is the product which I use. It's called Wavelink. Wavelink USB 3.0 docking station. I found it very useful. So you only need one connection to this Wavelink. The Wavelink will take that connection and it will actually allow you to connect multiple monitors to your single uh, USB port. So from Wavelink, I have one cable going to my laptop. With that, I am able to connect these three monitors using that docking station. Docking station is nothing, it's more like a splitter, you know, actually it will allow you to add more and more monitors to your computer with even even if even though your system does not support that many inputs so if you really want to actually have all these monitors without the docking station you will you would be having three different types of uh, places or actually options where you can plug in monitors to your laptop which is not possible i haven't seen any so this is what I did. So that is a power cable. Then I used three types of connections. Basically, uh, as you can see, it's pretty straightforward connections. If your monitor is just one or two or three or four, it is okay. It actually have the option to connect to that. So my laptop connects to this Wavelink USB 3.0 docking station. The docking station has all the out input actually I can connect my monitors to that way it is much easier and as you can see having I just want to give you a thought about my monitor options as well I have a 21 inch Lenovo that is the smallest one then I have a 24 inch and then I have a 32 inch so what I found is if you have a little bigger monitor you your productivity a little, little more improve the reason because you can see more of stuff in there so this is what my setting is and if i had a straight monitor at the end my neck will be paining i have to look in a different way so since i have a curved monitor it's just like i am looking around it's like a 360 view type thing you know it's uh, it's all around me it is not away from me it is around me and when you actually keep your monitor make sure it is it is on your eye level. When you sit on the table, it has to be in eye level. See, this is actually the output where I had all the docking station will be connected using that USB. And that's exactly how I connected my uh, all my monitors. Okay, so you can actually rearrange the way the monitors very easily. Okay, so all you need to type in just, just type display and you can see the display settings, right? Click on the display settings it will bring up a screen where you can rearrange it so if you if you just connected it you may not know which monitor is what what number associated with it all you can do is say say identify right or uh, if you say identify it will tell you which monitor is what so my leftmost is three middle one is two and the rightmost is four and the other one is the first one that's my laptop that's my primary that's my computer where i actually connect 
So since my laptop is sitting down, actually I drop my laptop just below the screen too. I can move around the monitors the way uh, the monitor is set up different way. Keep in mind, you need to do this, otherwise your mouse will be all over the place. You may not know, you won't be able to move your mouse across three monitors in one shot, right? So this will allow actually you to do that. If you haven't done, just say display settings, go there, then you can actually see this. And you can actually change all the resolution types for individual monitors and everything. Here, make sure that you actually extend uh, your monitor settings, okay? Otherwise, it will just mirror sometimes and it is it's much easy and always make sure your your eyesight is right on that otherwise your neck will pain so me make sure that you have a good chair and the monitors is not too high not too low it is always in your eyesight so yeah actually this will i i hope this will really help if you haven't tried that court monitor if you're planning to buy one i would actually strongly suggest go and buy one it is pretty cool. The clarity is really good. The make it the, the how it is different. See the 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 length of that one. It is it's about 32 inch. You know that it goes across. It is just not like straight line or anything. So these two monitors are straight flat monitors. And uh, yeah, it, it actually works okay. But I I would actually replace that small one that is a 21 inch Lenovo with a. 32 inch Samsung I think that will that will work great so if you have any plans to improve your work there you go all you need is actually a docking station which is a Wavelink USB 3.0 docking station it's only less than 100 bucks in Amazon so buy one connect to it arrange it and make yourself more productive so this is actually my tip of the day if you have any any suggestions or if you something if you find something cool please don't forget to share and if you haven't subscribed please do so thank you very much stay safe and uh, take care